not the world. Love not, N-O-T, love not the world. Continue. Neither the things that are in the world. Neither the things that are in it. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. Wow. The Most High, God said, if you love the world, then God does not love you. <laughs> I don't love the world. But well, now you're hating. Now you're Now you're hating. You can't hate, brother. You can't hate. Oh, you love the world. Uh oh. Stay over there. You love all this evil, this fornication. It's your bus, man. And all this other. No, it's not my bus. So fuck you, okay? <laughs> Now you're speaking hateful. He said we're hate, but he's fuck you. You just me, bro. That's fucked up. You got demons on you. Go ahead. That's, 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 that's worse. You saying fuck you, that's like, that's like a person. He says, he said we're teaching lies. He said God's only love, but he says fuck you. Here you go, the precept for you. Please ask 17. Therefore, I hated life. Yeah, we hate life. I hate stupidity is what I hate. Because the work that is wrought under the sun is grievous unto me, for all this been vexation of the spirit. Yeah, this whole world is vexation of the spirit. Especially the people, they vex the hell out of your spirit. Talking all that nonsense. Engaged in your fooleries. Let me look up that scripture. The fooleries. I'm going to get that scripture. Ain't that Ecclesiasticus? Oh, shit. That's an actual word, you know that? Yes, sir. Ecclesiasticus 22 and 13. Talk not much with a fool. Talk not much with a fool, and go not to him that hath no understanding. Beware of him, lest thou have trouble, and thou shalt never be defiled with his fooleries. Depart from him, and thou shalt find rest, and never be disquieted with madness. So that's what your boy was, he got, he was demanding stricken with madness. Coming up here with all this fooleries, bro. We ain't trying to hear them fooleries. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that talk without sense is called nonsense, no sense. These people out here make no sense. None. He said, God, why y'all saying God? Hates people. Then it starts cussing at us. Fuck you. This is Amos 5 and 10. They hate him that rebuketh in the gate, and they abhor him that speaketh up rightly. Yeah, they hate the people who speak right things. We're out here speaking righteousness. When have we said anything is wrong? Here you go. Verse 11. For as much, therefore, as he treading is upon the core, and you take the him, take from him burdens of wheat. You have built houses of huge stone, but ye have not dwelt in them. You have planted pleasant vineyards, but ye have not drink wine in them. For I know your manifold transgressions and your mighty sins. They afflict the just. They take a bribe, and they turn aside the poor in the gate from their right. Therefore the prudent shall keep silence in that time, for it is an evil time. The point here in 14, seek good and not evil, that ye may live, and so the Lord power, the power of hosts, shall be with you as ye have spoken. Hate the evil. Hate the evil. And love the good. Obviously. <laughs> and establish judgment in the gate. People, people talking out, oh, God is all love madness. Y'all sound stupid, man. The Lord clearly says, hate the evil, love the good. I mean, how hard is that to understand? Well, obvious must be hard. <laughs> you supposed to love wickedness? Yeah. yeah. But yeah, you supposed to love faggots now? You supposed to love pedophiles now? You supposed to love heathens? Scripture say, uh, good is evil, evil is good. Yeah, they turn everything upside down out here. Right. It may be that the Lord power of hosts will be gracious unto the remnant of Joseph. Therefore, the Lord, the power of hosts, the Lord saith thus, wailing shall be in all streets, and they shall say in all the highways and lands. Alas, and they shall call the husband in the morning, and such are skillful of limitation to wear. What's up with that? The, the main two scoffers we had today were plagued. One bitch was seriously obese and smelled like the stankingest bitch I've ever smelled. And the other dude was plagued with a skin disease. When we was talking about that was that's a unclean leprosy for your ass right there. 
Yeah. Right. He, he literally had giant warts hanging off his face, and he had the nerve to correct us. Yeah, he's out by the whole page of that shit out there water. He probably drinking it, you know, making teas and hot cocoa. Jacking off in it. Hot cocoa. I was really afraid of even getting anywhere near that guy. Uh, all right, bring it, man. Yeah. I saw that split and shit coming out, I'm like, oh, no. Oh, no. Ugh. I'm going to sleep right for several months and touch me, man. Shit, we got, yeah, we got to go home and, uh, yeah, we got to go do a purification of <laughs> right, right. ceremony. Hey, check it out, man. I know what's good, man. And there's these people, man. I was in the freaking park with my dog. And my fucking eating my kids come and won't touch me. I'm like trying to get away from me, man. And no motherfuckers been close to me, man. I feel Sometimes dirty, you just got to be mean. It's like, don't get the fuck away from me. Children got foul spirits on too. Oh, evil children. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. That's the little kids be killing cats and dogs and shit. Look, well, eating my baby be beating everybody up. And I'm telling you, man, not exaggerate. Several days I was feeling like a fat man, a nasty feeling around me, man. Being letting them dogs, letting them dogs touch my pet. <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah, that's right, Joe. Fucking children, mom and daddy fucking the fucking dog, family, the family pet. The children are working on the same thing. Boy, watch him. Oh, mom, that was sweet. How you caught that dog nut? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, he saw his family be weird, bro. Weird. Shit. What's up? What's up? Solomon 14 and 9. Oh, yeah. He says, for the ungodly, and his ungodliness are both alike hateful to God. That's why Lord, Lord does hate the sinner and he hates the sin. Just like then he said in Revelation 2, where he said. He hated, what's that one dude's name? The Nicolotain or whatever his name is? He said that Nicolotain's whom I hate. <laughs> so the Lord actually told you he, that was red letters, wasn't it? The Lord hates people. Jacob have a law, but Esau have a hater. Can't hear you. <laughs> I know my nigga. That's I know. not for you anyway. Right, 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 that's right, he can't hear you. That's right. He couldn't hear us if he could hear us. So, might as well have headphones on while we teach him. Well, you teach Israel, it could go on one ear right out of the other. Like the Lord said, y'all got ears, but you can't hear. Middle East is eating the fuck up. That drunk people in Iran is eating the fuck up. That got the people behind him too, because everybody loves Trump. They was against our war with Iran because Obama, they hated Obama. But now that the Trump wants to do it, it's all good. It, they, they, they blindly follow Trump. I was watching a Ron, uh, Ron Paul posted a video like what happened to the Tea Party. What happened, where'd it go? It's non-existent now. You know how that little liberty movement? Now it's all Trump, MAGA. Yeah, that's gone now. It, it doesn't exist. That whole liberty bullshit went out the window. But now everybody blindly following Trump. Like he's the Messiah. He's the chosen one. They say he's a great man of God. Your boy just looked at us again. I was watching a video. Yeah. Trump talking about prayer, the power of prayer. Oh, I don't want him over here. He's like Kyle that was on Facebook and Kyle didn't have no friends. Who want Kyle was some weird kid who couldn't have no friends on Facebook. So Kyle and his friends made friends with him. He was happy to him. Hey, let me get it. I want to get a scripture right quick. Revelation 20, uh, 22 and 14. Blessed are they that do his commandments that they might have right to be. This is like I mess up. Blessed are they that do his commandments that they may have right to the tree of life 
and may enter through the gates into the city. For without are dogs. What's a dog? He's a bitch, right? For without are dogs and sorcerers and whoremongers, murderers and idolaters, and whosoever loveth and maketh a lie. But that's the point I want to bring out. So the Lord love everybody. Why are calling them bitches? That's why they said bitch back in the old days. They can call you a dog. So the Lord himself called these people bitches. Now, puto. Puto. So people say we can't say that word, but the, the Lord himself called people dogs all the time. Yeah, snakes and vipers. A snake is not a nice creature. Say so you'd rather be called a dog than a snake. You know? What's going on, my brother? John 14 and I'm uh, starting 21. It says, He that hath my commandments and keepeth them, he it is that loveth me, and he that loveth me shall be loved of my father. So again, obviously, don't love the outside, the father don't love you. That's basic. Oh. Basic knowledge. Basic, basic common sense. You know what I'm saying? Don't take hard to break it. You don't need to break this down at all. You know what I'm saying? It's there. It's a thing. It's happening to it again. Well, they got ears, but they can't hear. It says, if a man love me, he will keep my words, and my father will love him. And we will come unto him and make our abode with him. He that loveth me not, keepeth not my sayings, and the words which he hear is not mine, but the father which has sent me. Yeah. 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 Well, they always talk that John 3.16 too, right? And look at that John 3.18. It said the same thing as what he just read. John 3 and 18, he that believeth on him is not condemned, but he that believeth not is condemned already, because he hath not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of the Most High. So the scriptures say if you don't believe in Yahweh Shai, that you are condemned. He didn't say he loves you, and he cares about you. No, he said you're condemned. And this is the condemnation, the light is coming to the world and men love darkness rather than light because their deeds were evil. That's why the, that's why the Israelites, they uh, killed Yahweh They Well, the Romans physically killed him, but they had him crucified. They said they had no king to see him. Same thing, people, I didn't want to kill us because we're doing the work of Yahweh Shai. For everyone that doeth evil hateth the light. What's the light is his truth, is Yahweh Shai. For everyone that doeth evil hateth the light, neither cometh to the light, lest his deeds should be reproved. But he that doeth truth cometh to the light, that his deeds may be made manifest that they rot in the Most High. They don't like the light. They definitely don't like you to shine the light on them. So everybody can see their wickedness. Sipping on some lean, busting some freestyles. Ooh. Whoso despises the word shall be destroyed. So you despise the words of the Lord, guess what? You're going to be destroyed. What? <laughs> Right, and that reward, that's that eternal life. That's a reward. The kingdom of heaven, that's the reward. The law of the wise is a fountain of life to depart from the snares of the death. It's a fountain of life. So this is the drinking fountain. This is where you're supposed to come up and drink right here. This is, a, this is an oasis in the middle of a barren wasteland. Because we out here in the middle of the desert. This is that oasis. This is where you come to get that water, that good water. It got a high pH level. This water got the high pH level. Yeah, we are in the valley of the dry bones out here. Oh, wait a minute. This is them. They see the desert. They see a mirage. Yeah, oh, there's mirages out there. Yeah. You get up there, you try to drink it. They're like, you drinking sand. That's all, that's all past a pork chop. It says, good understanding giveth favor, but the way of transgressions is hard. 
Every prudent man dealeth with knowledge, but a fool layeth open his folly. They let, he'll show you his folly too. He come out and act a fool, acting all bugged out crazy. You know, you see Jay, he walking down the street, headphones on, rapping at the top of his lungs, about some rap stuff, don't even make no sense. He's feeling it too. Yeah, he's feeling it. It's just, it's just a bunch of words with no meaning. Y'all gotta watch this video of uh, uh, music being turned. Uh, you, music being used as a weapon. Yeah, it is a weapon. Been turned into I think I've seen that. It's bad, man. It's, it's on bad, YouTube? Man, yeah, it's on YouTube. It's bad, man. Um, it says, a wicked messenger is falling from this tree, but a faithful ambassador is health. Poverty and shame shall be put to him that refuses instruction. Poverty and shame shall be put to him that refuses instruction. And that's another thing, too. A lot of Jason uh, brothers in the hood or whatever, you know, they always broke. Why are they always wasting all their money on weed? You know how much lean costs? If you drinking lean, then you ain't got no money. They waste all their money on weed. They waste all their money on alcohol, on lean, pills, zannies. And that's why everybody broke and ain't got nothing. Drugs, really, that shit costs cheddar, man. And you ain't getting paid enough to begin with. I don't know how you can even think about doing drugs. Every great payday, some people just set aside so much just to get their dope. Shit, weed is not cheap. They paying 50 or 8 for weed. That, that's like nothing. That's, that, that smoked up in one night. It says, poverty and shame shall be put to him that refuses instruction, but he that regardeth reproof shall be honored. The desire accomplished is sweet to the soul, but it is abomination to fools to depart from evil. It's an abomination to fools to depart from evil. Is that what that said? Wow. Wow, what scripture is that? Uh, is that 13? Proverbs 13. Uh, Read that one again. That was, 19, that's a bad scripture right there. It says, the desire accomplished is sweet to the soul, but it is an abomination to fools to depart from evil. It's a, an abomination to a fool to depart from evil. Uh, wow. That's amazing. And it's true. Nigga looking at you like, what the fuck, huh? I just killed this nigga for this dope, nigga. Damn. Hey, I get to go out and buy me a car now. And, you know what I mean? Like your boy that was out here that one week talking about, I just can't, I can't oh, stop the fucking other people's adulterous, bitches. Adulterous. You're probably dead now. <laughs> You're probably dead now. That's how I hate them motherfucking adulterers, man. I hate them, man. I hate them. And his answer was when I asked him, what happens to somebody fuck your wife? I just don't fall in love with you. I'm, that's your answer? <laughs> I just don't fall in love with you. I mean, I, just the idea of someone else is nut. I don't, I don't want to have nothing to do with that. No, that's nasty, man. That's trifling as hell. He that walketh with wise men shall be wise, but oh. a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Yeah, a companion of fools shall be destroyed, but he that walketh with wise men shall be wise. So we don't, I'm, we the only wise men I see out here. And there's only three of us. So <laughs> what does that say about everybody else? In the city with 1.4 million? That's a yeah. lot of motherfuckers. Because if they was wise, they'd be walking with us. But they're not walking with us. They're walking against us. What does the Lord say? He that is not with us is against us. So if you're not walking with us, you're not wise. That's all there is to it. That's a, that's a powerful chassis. Yes, sir. Deuteronomy 17 and 2. If there be found among you within any of the gates, I had to keep holding the scripture. I knew it was a good Oh, yeah, that's a good one, yeah. If there be found among you within any of thy gates, which the Lord thy power give to you, man, man or a woman. Man or a woman. Or oh, the woman, she the main one into paganism, idolatry. Those ain't got a free pass. She, she, the, the woman is the master of astrology. You know what I mean? She based her whole life, relationships, jobs, everything around that zodiac. Yeah. <laughs> now, what's your sign? Uh oh. -uh. It says, within any of thy gates, which are ruled by power, give man or woman that have wrought wickedness in the sight of the Lord thy power and transgressed in his covenant. And had gone and served by the gods and worshipped them, either the sun or moon, 
for any host of heaven. The host of heaven. Right, because they worship, they actually worship Venus. They call her the goddess of love. Hey, that's the love god, is Venus. They always talk about God is love, but they talking about Venus and Aphrodite. Uh, the queen of heaven. Titan. Yup. Yup. That's where Thanos is from. Yup. Yeah, they story on Titan. Yeah. Well, they, well, they try to say there's life on Titan. I don't know how they know that. Yeah, the Titan, every get a Titan, the 12 Titans. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So the Titans. Oh, man. 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 Oh, and it be told thee, and thou hast heard of it. And inquired diligently, and told it to the truth. Oh, okay, we heard. And God witnesses, and these people continue on their witness. Continue, continue on their witness. Witness? Or witness to the witness. And it's true. It says, and be found, behold, and be true. And the thing certain that such abominations have brought in Israel. You notice it says, in Israel, not all the worlds. World of worlds. Yeah. Then shall thou bring forth that man or that woman. Oh, so bring forth that man and that woman. So they let you know there's no free pass. There's no, yeah, there's no free pass. No, no get out of free. Not believe but get out of free. Get the ticket, whatever. The Lord is always very specific. We're not from now. Which have committed that wicked thing unto thy like gate. Oh, that wicked thing is all through the scriptures. All the wicked things. Shit, yeah, celebrating Christmas is that's worshiping another God. Because Christmas, then they say if they worship the sun or the moon. If you know the history of Christmas, you will know that Christmas is actually a, a worshiping of the sun. Because Christmas is held around the winter solstice. That's when the, the, the sun is at the lowest point in the sky. And the winter solstice is the shortest day of the year. So Christmas represents the days getting longer again. But you know, people don't know that. Because Christmas is actually sun worship, part of a solar cult. Uh -huh. Well, Islam is all about. The crescent moon with, with Venus next to it. And that's if Allah is a different God. They you know it's not the power, they're serving another God. Yep. Because uh, Baal's called, uh, uh, Baal's above, that's a Allah too. Well, Dagon is the Allah. He's the Allah of the uh, the Philistines. Yep. Some churches, Catholic churches, have a lot of things. Yeah. You see some cars got the sticker on the fish back up. That's crazy. That look like the bishop piece from the chess set. What's that? What is that symbol? What's that? Is that the symbol of the fish? Dagon. Dagon, the fish guy? Yeah. That's oh, a Philistine. Gagan. Gagan. That's his name, Gagan. It's like Starbucks. the the uh, Starbucks. Starbucks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like, you're right. That's the female version of it. That's probably his wife. All around is a symbol. Because they, they, uh, they use symbolism to control people's minds. The easiest way to convey a message is with an image. Yeah, I got it. Looking. Uh, water, I'm going to give you in every curse again. Signature right here. That's some, that's some free bikes everywhere. You see that one here, man? Do you? The water for so long. Now it locks up or something. It looks like some shitty ass bike, man. And my, my bike, I'll be kidding, bro. You see them laying on the middle of the street and picking them out sometimes. <laughs> There's a trial thing in the testing, they don't do that. It's a testing shit. This says, Then shall thou bring forth that man or that woman which have committed that wicked thing unto the gate, 
even that man or that woman again, and shall stone them with stones till they die. <laughs> so, I mean, that was the law. Back back when we was in our kingdom, if somebody blasphemy the Lord, they get stoned to death. That was what we was commanded to do by the Most High. Obviously, we can't do that now. We're supposed to teach repentance, right? Like, they really gonna repent. Hey, a few people will. We can get 911 now. Yeah, they can call 911. The cops are coming to protect them. So this devil does not allow us to keep any of our laws hard. We can't keep the Sabbath out here properly. Because according to the Bible, the Sabbath comes in on the new moon. And your boss at your job is not going to let you take every new moon off. Because it changes from month to month. There ain't no Sabbath in America. Oh, they, they done took the whole Ten Commandments and took a shit on it. Now it's legal to commit adultery. You can be an adulterer out here. You get rewarded for it. Get child support, food stamps, section eight. What, what other Ten Commandments they defiled? Murder. Murder. Well, well, you, I'm talking about they can't even keep that right. Murder. Yeah, murder. You see the, you see the government, the, the, the law enforcement murdering people at, just murdering motherfuckers, man. In black. black. On camera. Black, yeah. Israelites, Israelites. Not black, Israelites. That's what the Lord. That's what the Lord want to hear. The cry, man. You know, Lord don't hear cry. Because that's miseducation. That's part of their job is to make the people stupid. You know, white men say something, they go automatically believe it. You know, because he's in power. That's the devil's in power. So they automatically believe anything the devil tells you. Since when the devil tell the devil will tell you the truth? He don't lie about everything else. Fuck. Fuck. The devil tell you the truth. to be black. Your father is who are what your father is. Exactly, right? exactly, exactly, exactly. That's what I call it. That's exactly. Not who mama. <laughs> right. You know, because mama opened her legs to everybody. <laughs> you know? That's how Israel got scattered. Right. That's she ain't, She thinks she the cat. A cat can, a female cat can have babies by multiple male cats. That's right. weird. You know, that's crazy, ain't it? Yeah. That's crazy, man. And that's what she thinks. Yeah, hey, cute kitty cat. They call each other cat. They call them kitty cat. They call them the coochie cat. The cat. <laughs> you know? The kitty. The kitty cat. You know? But yeah, we are fathers, man. Our fathers go all back to Abraham, Isaac, Jacob. Right. You know? Our fathers go all back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Right. That's our forefathers. Yeah. Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Yeah. Yeah. Isaac, and Jacob. Yeah. That's our forefathers. Our forefathers ain't Esau and Agag and whatever the fucking heathens you come up with. Cain. You know, what are Pharaoh? Pharaoh, the Pharaoh, you know, calm. That ain't our forefathers' Pharaoh. Uh, Pharaoh was a heathen. Calm. So what are what are what is this? They're Hamites and Canaanites. Ham and Cain. And you got a lot of Israelites in Africa too, though. That's right. You got to try the spirits. A lot. You know, some Israelite groups would say all Africans are Hamites. That's bullshit. A lot of them, uh, especially on the west coast of Africa, this is almost all Israelites. Ghana. Ghana, Senegal, yeah. Sierra Leone. Zimbabwe. Yep. Those are Israelites. They don't know it, though. The right. Fulanis. They don't know it. They don't know it. A lot of them claiming to be right. Muslims yeah. and Christians, you know? So we're scattered amongst all those nations, you know? Just because we got brown skin, man, we ain't the same nation. We just amongst them, you know? Like the modern-day Egyptians, I'm, uh, the, the Sudanese, they descend from the ancient Egyptians. And you can see when you compare their faces like to the, the statues of the pharaohs and all that. They got the sharp pointy noses, just like the pharaohs. Uh -oh. And they got dark skin. Uh -oh. And they real uh -oh. tall. The no, nah, it ain't short. about appearance. I'm short now. So I'm, I'm just saying, but when you look at them. But check it out, man. That's how you know. We, man, we built them pyramids under slavery. Yep. Them pyramids and those ovals. But I must be seven ounce because I'm short now. Nah, you, that's just. Hello, man. We all short. And Israel coming all sides. We all short, man. Back we in all, that. All of us is like 10, 12 feet tall. Yep. A thousand years ago, man. We were all tall, man. Benching like 3,000. More than that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I've been conservative. What's that? Uh, what's that? Uh, Exodus 1? When they talk about our labor and brick and something like that? Yeah. Uh, I think that's Exodus 1.